Sometimes we have wonderful new opportunities in life, new beginnings. A new beginning can happen every morning when we get out of bed, or maybe it will be significantly new. In Isaiah 43, verses 18 and 19, the Bible says, Do not remember the former things, nor consider the things of old. Behold, I will do a new thing. There's great power in that. In human mind, we tend to hold on to things of the past. We tend to be a conservator of things that have been, maybe even things that are no longer working in our life. We have to go with God, and to go with God, it is always about new and wonderful things. Whatever you can do, or dream you can, begin it. Boldness has genius, power, and magic in it. Well, my friend, for you and for me, each new day is filled with opportunities. Opportunities to seek God's will. Opportunities to serve God's children. Opportunities to improve your own life and the lives of your friends and loved ones. Your twofold challenge is to look for these opportunities and then to seize them. Now that's twofold. Most people look for opportunities, but it's been my surprise in ministry how few will seize them. They'll be too, too trapped with fear to seize them. They'll have their foot on the brake of life instead of seizing them. And that's because it is too new for us to comprehend. That's because we're focused too much on the past. Don't dwell on what happened yesterday. Consider this day a new beginning, a fresh start, an open door to serving God and to serve God with willing hands and a loving heart. Ask God to renew your sense of purpose as God guides your steps and ask God to help you invest your talents in a wise way. God created this day and has given you the promise of a brand new beginning. Enhance it and make the most of it.